the first thing you need to do is to install an app so just go to the play store and then just type Moodle so actually this is the system the learning management system that you may use just click on this click install so the size of this app is quite small after you have installed the apps you can look for it in your handphone so this is how it looks like the Moodle this one just open this app okay just enter the UMS eLearning website select the correct one so this is the correct one you can key in the username and password just like what you key in, in the uh, website after you have successfully logged into your website to your learning management system website by using this app so this is the first thing that you will see and here what you can find is the there are two tabs, one is a dashboard, another one is site home. And then at the bottom, you can see the dashboard. So this is a dashboard. The second one is your school. My course. Okay, the courses that you have enrolled. And then there are some other uh, icon as well. But for now, we're just focusing on these two. Okay. So when you reach here, what you need to do first is to go to your course. See if the course that you have enrolled uh, for this semester already here. So if you cannot find uh, your course, what you can do, you can just go to the filter, click all. In this case, you will see all the courses, regardless the courses that you take in last semester or in the coming semester. If you still cannot find your course, what you can do, just go back to the dashboard. Okay. Go straight to the site home tab, search for the course. Okay, so you can key in a few uh, keywords. You don't really need to know the, uh, the, the, the title of the course, the full title. So for example, I just search for this ST01 something. Just click search. Okay, then you can find this course. Okay, so for example, the first one is the one that I need to enroll. That I have not enrolled yet. Just click on it. Okay, just check the name of the course. If this is a correct course, then you can just go to the bottom and click Enroll Me. Okay, so when you click Enroll Me, in this case, should be the biometry course. Then you can go to My Course page. And here you can see the course. And next thing you can do, of course, you can explore the course. You can just open it. Then you have access to all the content. And all these contents still need to be accessed when you connect to the internet. So now, if you uh, exit the app, and then in the future, when you open the app again, it will bring you directly to the uh, your course, okay? Your learning management system. Then what you need to do is just go to the My Course, Enter the cost. So you don't need to log in every time. So the user interface is slightly different from the web version. So what you can see, the top panel is the same. So you have the cost, participant, your grade, and some other option so we're not going to go into the detail for this one just copy to the course and then the next thing is need to learn how to uh, nav navigate it easily so what you can see here this is the first topic so the course is uh, using the uh, topic layout so this is my 
if you scroll up or down at the bottom you see the next topic is topic one and two so you can click next move to the next topic okay and then the same thing you also can go to the topic three and so on and so forth so if you want to jump to the specific topic without going through one by one so there's a icon at the bottom right three dot with three line just click on this so this is an in text cost in text so you can choose the one that you want not only to the section but to the material okay so you can click on this okay you will bring you directly into the youtube okay at the same time you can see there's an error at your right side you can click on this one so this is some shortcut to the material for example if i only want to look for the assignment to rather than such an assignment a topic by topic section by section i can click on this assignment so they will list out all the assignment from different session okay so this is how you can uh, navigate your course uh, by using this app easily so most of the material can be assessed when you're online so one way to try it is that uh, you can try to assist from the app and then just turn off your wi-fi and internet try to open the app again so as you can see at the bottom there's a notification your device is offline so you can try go to the course click on it okay might be a surprise for you is that uh, you still be able to read all this content okay you only can read the text for example if you go to this one okay so you still be able to read the text as the app has downloaded the cost pages and also the topic description however it will be not possible for you to access the material because this is not downloaded so this is how it looks like so to fix it there is a way to do it so as you can see um for the learning material especially the powerpoint and some attached file what you can do you can just uh, download this into the app so here at the top right corner you can see the cloud icon with the error you can click on this download button cost download okay So you can check one by one which one you want to download first okay. so this is an outline the topics so you can click this one download the course so you download the entire course or you can download the topic by topic okay and item by item so if you have enough space in your handphone you can just download the entire course download course if you don't have enough you can download a few um, topic first so in D here is running. So for example, topic one and two, there are seven content that can be downloaded. So for example, this too far, but the in the link to the U, uh, YouTube video cannot be downloaded. And so the next thing I want to show you is how to download the video and manage it properly. Uh, it's impossible to download the video in this app if the video is deposited at YouTube unless the video is uh, uploaded directly to the system then you can download the video but it, yeah, it will take up a lot of space in your handphone so now for example i just go to one of the topic okay go to cost in text let's say to this one our calculator okay then i just go to the week okay and then here you can see a lot of the link to the video so this is all the videos Okay, so for example, this is video link. So if I am offline, let's try. I not have access to the internet. If I click on the link, okay, we will say that yeah, this is in the YouTube. If you click OK, nothing will happen because it's not connected to the internet. Okay, so what you can do is when you connect to the internet and if you want to keep the video uh, for some time to review the video without all the time connected to the data and internet 
So what you can do is you can just uh, connect to the Wi-Fi and internet first. Click on the link. Same thing, go to the YouTube. Okay, when you're online. In and the past few weeks, you have done... Just pause the video. Here, there's a download button. Click download. So this will only work if you have the YouTube app installed in your handphone, which I believe you have that already. Somebody want to access the video, what you can do, you need, need to go to the YouTube. Okay, go to the YouTube app. Go to library. Download. Okay. Go to YouTube, library, download. So this is your video. Okay, so this is the one that we just downloaded. So even now, if you are offline, you still can watch the video. In the past few weeks, you have done... Okay. So I hope that this will help you a lot, okay, in your study. That's all. Several statistical.